Hi guys, we're back here with old Barry, and uh, I want to take a few minutes, and uh, before I forget to do it, actually, and uh, a while ago I, I promised I'd reveal a kind of a little secret I've been keeping uh, about one of the reasons why we started the Barry and DR segment uh, of uh, this and continued on till this very day. Um, Everybody knows uh, who reads our post and follows us that uh, I've been for a long time with a, a, a group of four guys. Um, I'm the four, so three others. And we call ourselves the mentors. We're just friends that love doing research and, like I say, peeling the onion, doing this apophatic research and getting to the details. And, and we've been fortunate to be extremely accurate over the last decade of doing it, which is... Uh, a good thing right about now to be honest with you in terms of relaxation and no worry but I promised I'd realize I, I'd reveal one of the uh, bigger reasons we did this and now's a great time to do it because unfortunately of uh, you know what what this uh, staged lockdown did um, it's it's totally destroyed the economy but uh, Information right now is running rampant. It is running so inaccurate. It's very difficult for so many people to uh, gather something that's worthwhile that they can take and maybe try to put the pieces together a little bit for the future. Anyway, um, what turned out to be a win-win situation really started like this. We anticipated because if you go back to our articles, you're going to see five, six years ago, this is what we were saying about this year. Very much the political aspect, the prices of the commodities and this and that. And we knew one day around 2020, 2021, this was going to be great. Now think about it today. With all the misinformation, how valuable would it be to have almost 15,000 people located all over the, all over the planet? 15,000 people that either are on this YouTube channel, that website, or you do business with them, or another YouTube channel, or a past YouTube channel that still gets shown. Uh, my question is, though, in this day and age, with everything so misguided and everybody running around, people scared and in total chaos, not knowing what they're doing, what value would solid, honest information be worth in a day like today? Okay, so now you understand my little secret. Uh, all four of us were for this, but uh, we knew one day this information source would just be phenomenal tool to have. And it's going to help our families as we navigate these uncharted waters into the future. And uh, I just wanted to share that with you uh, before I forgot, because I promised I would. And uh, with all the different videos doing, because there's no traveling, uh, I, I didn't want to get carried away more on, uh, on other subjects and forget to tell you our little secret. So uh, all four of us are exceptionally, uh, we never dreamed it would work like this, but if we want information, let's say something's forwarded to us, uh, whatever, in any part of Europe, Australia, whatever, China, and all, well, chances are within, within you know, a, a close distance we're gonna we're gonna have a, a way of finding out there and uh, boy is it valuable to get what what is being told on the media versus what is actually happening uh, pardon that pun with boots on the ground be it footage be it people living in those areas and yeah people are being scared uh, ridiculous uh, a ridiculous amount for no apparent reason but again I don't argue with that if that's what their choice I'm just revealing why the secret was because you know closed minds are gonna stay like they're like rusted traps I mean my goodness uh, did you even know two two and a half years after the Wright brothers took their first flight there were still people denying after it was common for, for over a year to take these short flights, there were still people denying that man can fly. You know, and, and otherwise, it's at times, you know, if you looked at it from our side too, where you try to help and, and, dis, and, and disclose good, solid, unbiased information. And those who don't study history, we've all heard this, so are doomed to repeat it. Everybody knows that. But what about us, us kind of folks? Yet those who do study history and are forced to sit by and helplessly watch people destroy themselves because of their own closed mind. 
Do you think that brings any pleasure when you're, you're spending your time trying to show people they're going down a wrong path? So we knew one day this was going to be like gold in the bank, and it, and it is. It's only going to get better as, unfortunately, violence picks up. This is only going to get better uh, for us, more useful, more valuable, rather. Anyway, guys, I wanted to, before, I, and we'll move on and continue to, uh, we're going to be moving, you know, onward, though, uh, veering off the highway of the uh, COVID-19, because if it's not making sense to you now that you've been hoodwinked, it never will. Although it does look like around the world, though, a, a fair amount now, a fair amount are starting to open up at least one eye. And yeah, because they're seeing, you know, common sense is prevailing. Anyway, uh, shame it ain't so common. But uh, we'll keep up on that. So uh, in, in, any, in any event, uh, we thank all the bits and pieces. Uh, we thank all the people with their comments. And yes, we, if we uh, sound uh, like a lot of people say you sound relaxed, yeah, well, we are. We live in the country. It's really not that big a difference, except a few restaurants have closed up. Other than that, it's pretty much the same. If it rains, you know, it makes grass. If it makes grass, the cows and the chickens are happy. If the cows and chickens are happy, they make little cows and little chickens. And like Sonny and Cher used to say, and the beat goes on, you know, it's not that exciting, but it sure is sustainable. Right about now, it sure wipes uh, chaos right off, uh, right off the map for us anyway. If, if you if you follow accurate information. If not, like I say, I, we know just as many people around us too that are just shuddered in fear, but again, it's their choice. Anyway, uh, thanks a lot, we'll keep up, and uh, have a great afternoon. It's old Barry and DR, bye.